I've sort of decided that this going to this local bagel place and getting coffee from a local place that's not the bagel place, but it's I can walk to it from my apartment. I walk to both of these places and I get coffee first. And this is a nitro cold brew, even though today it's relatively cold for here. It's in the 40s, the upper 40s, but the sun was shining and I didn't feel like getting an Americano. So I splurged. I got the nitro cold brew. It sure is smooth. Good morning, everyone. We are um, on our way to making uh, real videos, right? With this microphone, and I got um, a, a gimbal arm, which I'm very happy about. So you can see um, that's the picture that's above me, and there's that picture, and then that's a mirror, and none of these are mine. Um, this is a furnished apartment. I shot some footage the other day, and it, um, yeah, I just say, um, way too much. And it's fucking annoying to edit out. So that's a vocal tick I'm going to try and solve. I was considering taking y'all outside, but it's kind of cold. suffer so everything bagel with kimchi cream cheese again I really didn't think that it was gonna be like the theme of my channel for the first few videos would be kimchi I'll probably replace um with so so I might say so a lot uh, so Maybe it's one of those things that's just very obvious only if you're in this only if you're doing something very specific like editing a bunch of footage of yourself talking I really don't want to alienate people that don't like eating noises I can show you oh god and you can see my yoga mat that's in my hamper because I need to clean it this is why I don't fucking move it. Cause I'm scared. I'm gonna fuck it up. But I'm gonna fuck it up anyway. So I may as well. <laughs> but I, I just want to recreate scenes from movies. Uh. That was an okay, that was more like an ah, uh, not an um. But we create scenes from movies, specifically starting out with Reservoir Dogs. So I really like Mr. Orange and I just wanna do all the Mr. Orange scenes. And then that got to be a pain in the ass. I had people calling me on the phone, calling me all the fucking time. I couldn't even run a tape without having six fucking phone calls interrupt me. Hey, when's the next time you're getting some? Motherfucker, I'm trying to watch The Lost Boys. When I get some, I'll let you know. And one of those scenes, of course, is him in the back of the car after he's been shot in the stomach. And that's not really a spoiler because it's in the beginning of the fucking movie. And if you haven't seen Reservoir Dogs, you should stop watching this right now and watch Reservoir Dogs. Listen to me, Martin Nash. I'm a cop. <laughs> so, get your life together. Priorities. Just kidding. Just kidding. So yeah, I want to recreate scenes from Reservoir Dogs, including that scene, but I'm not going to have another person. 
Maybe the apex of my creative work will be acting with myself. That's the, that's the one thing that links all of these videos together. Me. I don't have a lot of desire to be a director, obviously, maybe not obviously, you know, and here on this channel, it's, I'm just acting like myself a version of myself, the persona, I'm playing the persona of me for you. But, you know, the recreation of scenes from Reservoir Dogs, it's not gonna be some kind of like acting showcase. I've always had a desire to be an actor, but it was kind of squashed you know, pretty early on and sort of why I shifted into academia, because it felt much more legitimate. And then, because that was a mistake. <laughs> Not a mistake. No, make no mistakes. There's no, no regret. That turned out to not be extremely sustainable <laughs> in terms of a career, which is why I then shifted into computer stuff, for lack of a better term, I guess data. So if that means, you know, making random content, I just want to do, you know, fun stuff. And if you like watching me, you'll like watching these, or you won't. There's a part where Mr. Bond is like, He says either he got shot or not. I can't remember, but he... What the fuck did you do? You started shooting everyone. I think Harvey Keitel, because he's like really mad at Mr. Blonde. He's like, what the fuck? You fucked it all up. And Mr. Blonde's just like forever perma-cool. He got shot. Either he got caught or he got shot. I don't know. I can't remember. Yeah, I just want to do scenes from Reservoir Dogs. And then maybe other movies. I don't know. Sort of a low budget silly thing oh and I was going to say in terms of doing any kind of blood because I do again I love Mr. Orange but I don't think I mean it would be funny maybe I'll do a few iterations of it and at some point you may see like a big plastic tarp and then like I'll have a lot of fake blood and I'll just be laying in the fake blood and I'll do it for real. But for now, if I post stuff, which I will, I definitely am going to post these. It's, there's not going to be any. You're just going to have to use your imagination. Hey, when's the next time you're getting some? Motherfucker, I'm trying to watch The Lost Boys. When I get some, I'll let you know. They don't want $60. They want ten dollars worth. Bringing it up is a major fucking pain in the ass because I don't even know what ten dollars worth looks like. Motherfucker, I'm trying to watch The Lost Boys. When I get some, I'll let you know. And these ring-eating potheads start coming by and my friends and everything, but still, I got all my shit laid out in $60 bags, but they don't want $60 worth. They want $10 worth, and breaking it up is a major fucking pain in the ass because I don't even know what $10 worth looks like. And then that got to be a pain. And then that got, and then, and then that got to be a pain in the ass. And then that got to be a pain. And then that got to be a pain in the ass. I had people calling me on the phone, calling me all the fucking time. I couldn't even run a I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die, I know it. I'm gonna die. I can't believe she killed me, man. Who the fucking thought?